I have had constituents who have had their carers help them struggle to my constituency surgeries uh, to tell me about the difficulty they are having with the process. People who are, being, who are, who are blind, who are, who are un- incapable of work, walking unaided, who are yet ha- having to go for work capability assessments. It is humiliating and degrading, and it should be paused. Those things should be fixed and taken out of the system. I am happy to give way, yes. Thank you to the honourable gentleman for giving way. Um, a key point that I have noted as well is that the government has lauded the idea that it is going to be an entirely online system um, for processing universal credit. But my constituency, um, which is one of the highest claimant counts in Scotland, 35% of people do not have access to internet. Surveys by the Citizens Advice Bureau have said 32% of people will, have totally, uh, will be totally unable to access the system. 30, another two, 32% will have great difficulty in doing so. Is that not just a Kafka-esque nightmare that further frustrates and demoralises and depresses the poorest and most vulnerable people in our society? I, I thank the honourable member for his contribution, and I completely agree.